So uh, there's this YouTuber called Sapiti that's go that's like making FNF drama, a novel drama, like Genshin Impact. I don't know what Genshin Impact is. It doesn't look good. That's all I could say. That it just looks like another pay-to-win mobile game on the consoles. So uh, apparently, he uh, well, I checked out his channel because a lot of people have been raiding it with cheese emotes. Don't know why, but uh, yeah, some Reddit raiders, everyone just raided him for this controversy. But uh, basically. So, you know what he does to get views? No, if you're saying he covers trending drama topics. No, no, no. He's not one of those tea spilling channels. Instead, he is this literal, uh, rule 34 in his, uh, thumbnails to get clicks. And it works. And I looked at the previews and there's no, any, no 34 in the videos. When you hover over your video and it plays, yeah, that's that's it. So basically, uh, he uses, you know, those images. And when he was covering the Sky drama, it, remember the Sky mod? Yeah, that got uh re trashed off of Game Banana because apparently it ruined the TikToker's life because everyone was just spamming those Rule Thirty Four images. Yeah, guess what? Sapiti did. Alright, I need to get the clicks. I need to get some clicks. Yeah, I don't know. I know. Look up child pornography. Since Sky is technically 13 in the game and people are drawing loot out of her, it's technically child cheese pizza. Cheese pizza. Yeah, you get what it means. So, while Sapiti is looking up cheese pizza to put in his thumbnails, everyone just starts raiding him and nobody's acknowledging the fact that he does this for clicks. Yeah, sure, let's look up cheese pizza. Pretty sure that won't make any problems. Because it doesn't. Nobody cares about the thumbnails. And then, like, everyone's saying... And then he's talking about Friday Night Funkin' NSFW ads. Yet he puts NSFW in his thumbnails. This guy's logic's broken. Also, uh... Uh, when he covered that whole Psychic Noodles or something... Drama, uh, where she, where she released the Cassandra mod, and they got over, the Friday Night Funkin' community got upset. Yeah, it got upset, because, wanna know why, huh? Because, apparently, Cassandra's was, Cassandra, uh, was girlfriend's sister. So, yeah, everyone got really mad, and they found out she was a trans woman. Trans, I mean, sorry. Uh, she, uh, they found out that her, they was a trans. I, I can't get pronouns right, man. But since, uh, taking noodles is a trans, they started hurling, um, uh, trans insults at them. Transphobic, uh, statements. So, yeah. And this guy... You know, I'm gonna cover it, and I'm gonna show a clip of her crying on live. Yeah, okay. But, uh, everyone just started raiding him. On the Reddit, that post was, like, severely downvoted. But everyone just fucking raided it. Uh, even some, uh, really top people in the community. Uh, like, who just have check marks. They're not really top people, they just appear. Uh... Started commenting on it, and it just kind of got out of hand. And then, as soon as that video, like, stopped losing traction, everyone just stopped raiding. They don't care anymore. But, uh, yeah. Uh, end of video, I guess.